Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of a BNT brand and on Amazon it's called A-Zone. This is the LIFY Shield version 1 Wi-Fi outdoor security camera. This is model TL-K9. Now you can see the cameras right here in front of me. It says BNT on there. Bottom has a microphone. This is where you play power and it has a cable and an exit right there in foam and here's where the Wi-Fi antenna goes and it comes with a nice Wi-Fi antenna that we're going to screw around to there comes with a tool to adjust and lock these pieces right here to adjust the angle and it comes with a screwdriver and some drywall mounting so that you can mount that and a template and a instruction manual and a quick user's guide and a sticker if you want to put on your window warning people that you have the security camera on there now you can also see that it comes with a AC adapter that's going to plug into here and power this and of course the angle of this is fully adjustable when you loosen that right there and you can see the front of the camera is very nice very high quality so you can tell it's very uh, sealed unit and it's IP66 waterproof so looking at that slide you could see that this will work outdoors quite nicely based on that rating now some of the other specs um, you have to be within 50 feet or about 15 meters from your Wi-Fi router to have this work properly if not you're going to need a repeater uh, this is 1080p HD with uh, a clear two-way voice so there's a microphone and a speaker in this the software in the app has motion detection it's a 115 degree view out of the lens and 360 degree microphone sound is available and and responding sound with that speaker there also it has motion alert software night vision cloud storage capability and uh, it includes a ring of 18 infrared LEDs that you can't see are behind that plastic 850 nanometer wavelength and that allows you to get that night vision the unit will operate temperature wise from 14 degrees Fahrenheit up to 122 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 10 degrees centigrade to 50 degrees centigrade it has lifetime tech support from the seller and manufacturer who is BNT and one year warranty and a 30 day return policy. Now the first thing I'm going to mention is the app. The app in the manual has a scan code but I wanted you to know what the app is so you look ahead of time. It is um, from YL Technologies Incorporated and what you're going to search for on the Google Play Store is uni.smartcamera. That's Y-U-N-I dot smart camera. And it'll be the first one that comes up and I'm gonna have a link in my description also so you know where that app is the app is really rated high 4.7 out of 3,000 comments so that's a good sign because there's nothing worse than having a good piece of hardware and a bad app so you could check that out the app is gets very good ratings now we're gonna be uh, going to this manual and we're gonna be powering this up and see if I can get it to hook to my Wi-Fi network on my house so first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to use that included tool. Let's just try this right here and we can loosen that and then we could change the angle of this. So I'm just going to pick an angle right there for now and then tighten it. It also has a way to use that side also, which is nice. And then we're going to put the included 2.4 gigahertz. This is only 2.4 gigahertz. It doesn't work on the 5 gigahertz bands. And you want to tension that just like that by going clockwise and if it's tight enough you can rotate this and it won't come loose now you can see that in the manual they do have a QR code you can scan that with your mobile phone and there's a symbol of the app right there if you don't have that uh, app on your phone you can get one for free or just go to the link that I provided on the bottom of the unit there is the speaker and they have this included little screwdriver 
and when you open this up right here there should be a little sealed port and they they map that sealed so that moisture won't go in there so if you open that up there is an SD card already in the unit and it looks like it comes with a 32 gigabyte micro SD card that's nice I didn't even know it came with one so we're gonna put that right back in there and we're going to uh, use this tool to push it down and just click it right in there just like that now I'm gonna put a uh, flashlight on it so you can really see that so right there is the SD card and you just can push it to remove it to get your data and it's very simple once you get the app on your phone, instructions tell you very clearly that you have to set up an account. And there is an account set up right on the app and you want to do that first. It'll send you a code to your email address. And then once you do that, it'll acknowledge that and you put that code into the app and then you're all set up. Now on the camera itself, there's this cable. It's about a foot long and you could see it has power right there to match the included AC adapter. And on the other side, there's a sealed reset button right there. And we're going to explain what that's for. It's when you first power this up, it says that the start of the camera makes sure the device makes a, a DD sound, it says, and the indicator is in the red flashing state. So um, if it does not do that, you can hit that manual reset button. So the AC adapter has a nice cable on here. It's about 10 feet long. Okay, so I have the uh, AC adapter plugged in to a 120 volts, 115 volts. Now we're going to power it. Okay, so it took about 10 seconds and it made that nice little sound, nice and loud. And then it did those two ding sounds that it talked about. So if it didn't, you could hit that reset button to actually have it do the same thing. Now it says uh, connect the camera to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi network. Make sure the Wi-Fi network is in good condition. So we're going to run the mobile app. We're going to go get the mobile app on my cell phone. We're going to try this. Okay, I lowered the studio lights considerably so we can see what's going on here. So you can see I have the app right there, Y-L-L-O-T. And you can see the symbol matches. Let's open that app up. So there's that double reap. Let's hit that. Then it has my network on there. And enter a password. I'm going to enter my password right here. Okay, I put my password in. I'll hit OK right there. Connect to Wi-Fi. Please face the QR code towards the camera lens and wait for it to scan. Pretty neat. So I pointed the camera there. Now it says next. It says retrieving pairing status. Pairing is successful. Pairing you is can success start using your camera pairing now. Pairing is successful. You can start using your camera now. Then hit save. Then it says that you can purchase cloud subscription or you can hit start using. So right there, there's what the camera sees. I can point outside, there's by my window right there, there's by my green screen area. So it's obviously working and it's connected. Let's just set it right there. I want to point out that the image is just uh, crystal clear. Uh, the 1080 progressive frames, it's got a very clear image on here. So I'm going to show you the night vision. I shut off all the studio lights and you can see that it is showing my studio in total darkness and the camera is probably not picking it up but the image is 
really crystal clear on there. It's just very nicely done. Uh, so you can see that as soon as the darkness level increases, you see it click on right there. And then what it's doing, it's going to night vision. So I have the sensor blocked so that you can see those infrared LEDs right there. And that's what's providing the night vision. So what do I think about the BNT, the A-Zone LIFY Shield Model TL-K9 security camera? I like this camera, and like most of these cameras that use Wi-Fi, it's gonna take some time to learn the app. Once you learn the app, you're gonna like this camera. Uh, the quality of this is very, very good. It's very solid. Uh, it has a good feel to it. You could tell it's waterproof. So I like this. I'm gonna give it a full five star rating on my channel. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you learn to new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helps you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.